This video is all about how to write half equations in electrolysis. To begin with, an ionic compound is split up into its ions. The positive ions move towards the negative electrode and the negative ions move towards the positive electrode. At the negative electrode, electrons are donated to the positive ion to make an atom. For example, in the case of a sodium ion, sodium ions would gain one electron to become a sodium atom. This is called a reduction reaction. In this equation, one copper ion has a charge of 2 plus. It gains an electron to become a copper atom. As you can see, one electron does not cancel out the 2 plus charge, so we need two electrons. Because we have two electrons, in front of the E sign here, we need to write a big 2. Let's try another one. In the case of aluminium, an aluminium ion gains electrons to become an aluminium atom. As you can see, aluminium has a charge of 3 plus, therefore it needs three electrons to make it into an aluminium atom. This means that in front of the electron sign here, we need to write a big 3. In electrolysis, the negative ion moves towards the positive electrode. The negative ion donates an electron to become an atom. In the case of chlorine, a chlorine ion would donate one electron to become a chlorine atom. This is called oxidation. In the case of chlorine, this reaction happens twice to make chlorine CO2, which is a diatomic molecule. Let's take a look at that again. One chlorine ion loses an electron to become a chlorine atom. However, chlorine exists as Cl2, which is diatomic. Therefore, we need two chlorine ions. Each chlorine ion donates one electron each. That means I have one, two electrons. Therefore, in front of the electron sign, I need to write a big two. As I also have two chlorine ions, I need to write a big 2 in front of the chlorine ion sign. Let's try another one. In the case of oxygen, oxygen forms an O2 minus ion. When it donates electrons, it becomes an oxygen atom. Oxygen also exists as a diatomic molecule. This means the reaction needs to happen twice, so I need two oxygen ions. Each ion donates two electrons. This means I have four electrons donated, so in front of the E sign here, I need to write a big four. As I also have two ions, in front of the O2 minus ion sign, I also need to write a big two. This is the half equation for the oxidation of oxygen.